It's travel day. It is 6.16 a.m. Saturday, July 13th. And I am in my car getting ready to go to the airport so that I can take my first international solo trip. I have never traveled out of the country alone. It's always been with family or an ex. But today, this trip, this trip is about me finding a renewed spirit, being able to do a hard reset, being able to increase my confidence and my self-esteem and just overall build, <clears throat> excuse me, it's still early, build my belief in me. And I am so excited. So I am about to first swing by my dad's house because I forgot to take some medicine for Dylan. Um, and then I have to stop by the ATM because I don't, I don't want a lot of cash on me, but I need some cash. And then we're going to go to the airport. I am so excited, but I'm nervous at the same time because out of the country by myself. Hold on. You know what? Let me do. Cause what if I had gotten on an airplane? I got my passport and I have my driver's license. And I have my debit card that I'm going to take, my credit card that I'm going to take. Okay. Listen, as long as I got some money, baby, I can replace anything else. So, let me shimmy on down to my dad's. Guys, I am going to try my best to record this entire process and this entire journey. Because this is bigger than just taking a vacation. This is me gaining the encouragement to know that I can do anything I set my mind to. I already knew that because I've accomplished a lot of great things in life. But in a moment of transparency, some things over the last calendar year has that's happened has me doubting myself. And what better way to regain that confidence than to travel solo internationally and get some rest and do a reset listen i'm killing all the birds with all the stones right right all right y'all supposed to be in and out of harmony so i packed up all my things there was nothing left to see so how did you find your way back in my life so i am at the airport i am parking why? Because I am going to leave my car at the airport. Do I have plenty of people that would have loved to drop me off and pick me up? Absolutely. But I come in so late Wednesday that I do not want to have anybody up at that time of night. I also thought about Ubering. I thought about... Um, getting somebody to drop me out. I just I don't want to. I hate inconveniencing people and although I know that there are people that would have loved to help me I don't like waiting either. Am I the only one? Am I the only one and when I'm ready to go I'm ready to go. Do you hear me? I don't want to be sitting waiting on you for 20, 30, 40 minutes when I walk out this gate and I get my bag. Oh, I ain't even got to get no bag because I'm not checking no bag. See, when I'm ready to go, I'm ready to go. So I'm going to park my car. I believe it is $20 a day. Ballet was like $35 a day. What What I need that for? I don't need that. I need to park this car. And there is a shuttle that runs every 10 minutes. So I am going to wait on this shuttle. I'm really excited that I don't have any bags to check. I don't think y'all understand how much stress that causes me because what I hate doing is thinking that I've got my weight on my bag correct to get up there. It's overweight. Then they tell me that I have to pay an extra ABC fee and I, I'm not doing all of that. I'm not doing all of that. So let me go in here, get this car parked, and then 
the shuttle is already here. So let me hurry up so I can get on this shuttle, y'all. Got the shuttle to myself, but I feel like I'm running behind because I really wanted to be checked in by now. It's 7.20. My flight leave at 8.30. I'm okay, right? I'm gonna make it. I ain't got no choice but to make it, right? <laughs> but my sense of nervousness is starting to subside a little bit. Once I get checked in and I know I'm at my gate, it'll be even better. I almost missed my flight. I went to the wrong port, wrong gate. I underestimated TSA. I did not do this QR code e-ticket. It is nothing but the grace of God. I'm finally able to breathe, Lord. I'm discombobulated because I surely thought I was about to miss that flight, but I made it. I am in the airport at Washington, D.C. for my layover. I'm about to get some coffee before I die and take a breather. I don't even have anything else to add to y'all until I get to my resort. Passengers traveling on flight 1940 service into Atlanta. It ain't my flight. That's all I'm worried about. All what do I need to do? Okay. So let me give me something to drink, y'all, and sit down and take a deep breath. Because I don't even know if y'all can hear me well. But I'm making this thing work. Go bow for the result, oh. Nothing to discuss, oh. Cause I take my wife without and without any doubt, oh. I'm a me, I be a doubt, oh. I no go feed the girl, I no go feed the girl is out, oh. I'm a mind that's with the talk, oh. I put my life into my job and I know I'm in trouble. She manipulate my love, oh. Uh, fine, fine, oh, back at that, uh, watch your love 
con la que hay. Why not? 